Welcome to the vlog. In today's episode, we have a big problem. It's actually kind of little because we've got mice. Bum, bum, bum. Another poo dropping. Another Star Wars clothes. Of course, will not be with that right anymore. I think it's probably a gerbil. Well, if it wasn't. We're going to turn this into a pet. Carry it with us on the No, we're not. No. We're going to force it to leave its home. Expand it. Okay, I'm going to let Molly handle it. Fortunately, it's camping world right across the way, so we can go across there and get what we need. What time is it? Did you want to say something about this? How do you feel about being invaded by Rabbit? mouse? Come on. I don't know really even what it looks like. Mm. I don't see any of them. I didn't. You need to show me. Here's another piece of rock. Look. Show me them with the poo droppings look like. That, that small brown. Mm -hmm. Tiny brown thing. Oh, that's a cool little poo drop. Tiny brown thing. Yeah, it could be a centipede dropping. No, it's not. They don't think we poo. <laughs> Earthworm dropping, maybe. Dad went to work trying to find where the mice were. Alright, so Molly's gotten the drawers cleaned out. There's only about four or five poo droppings to sign. But we did find another one over here with the kids' clothes. So there is some ways and access points up under it. So basically, I'm going to pull these drawers out and see what we're dealing with here. So, while I'm doing that, I'm watching a video from somebody about getting rid of mice. Oh, we found some clothes. Hey, uh, here's another swimsuit, maybe? Oh, yeah, that's Um, I don't really see much in there. I'm gonna move some, move some stuff around and see what's up. Hopefully I didn't shoot through any of this ventilation stuff. It's on film. Yeah, it's on film. How do you feel about being infiltrated by mice? That's how you feel about the mice? Because they killed mom's pink flamingo shirt. And I liked it. Okay. You don't see any I don't see any droppings down there, which is good. Well, the reds might be in the tunnels. There, I'm gonna put you right there. Okay. It's crooked. I'm sorry. Let, here, let. Yeah. Hello. Hello. Staring contest. Who can stare the longest? We're doing the staring contest. Do the staring contest with YouTube. Tell me when you stop blinking. I think you already stopped blinking. Um. Ah! I saw okay. me blink! I'm gonna get my. There. Hello! Where did. Uh, we don't see any mice droppings down there, so mm -hmm. that's good. It looks pretty clean. Yeah. No, it, it doesn't thing. look that clean, does it? Well, it's, it's, I mean, it doesn't have mice dropping. It's got yeah, a bunch of clean. wires. From, the, it looks clean from mouse, mice and mice poop. What are you doing? What are you actually really going to do? Go to the pool. <laughs> Wait. See ya. I'm just kidding. Off to solve the, off to solve the mice problem. Oh, 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 oh. I think you're a nut job. Alright, so earlier 
I went to Camping World and I got some like uh, stuff that you put in. I'll find the name of it here shortly. But anyways, it's way too smelly. So we're gonna do peppermint spray. So I'm gonna try to get a spray bottle and some traps from. The Home Depot. I have no real clue where the mouse trap stuff is, but I'm gonna assume it's near the insect stuff. That's a live animal cage. All right, so it's crazy because everything they have here like kills the rats. I guess. I mean, I'm not against people that want to kill them. I mean, I get it. It's kind of a way society is, but it's part of like being so much in nature lately that. I think I'm kind of changing my perspective, so if I don't have to, then why would I, is I guess how I feel. So I'm going to try these. Now, I'm a little worried that they're not going to work as well, because they're supposed to be set up like against a wall. So, maybe a bad idea, but we'll, we'll try them and see, and if it's not working, then we'll go to plan B, and we may have to get rid of these critters permanently. These, and we'll plug that in, it's right by the bed, it actually hit both of the key areas where we've seen the mouse droppings and uh, hopefully between all that we'll have a permanent solution to our current mouse problems. Home Depot hopefully will save the day. Alright so we got quite a few options. Uh, option number one we're going to be doing is we heard peppermint works really well so we put some oil, peppermint oil in here and we're going to wipe down all the drawers and I'm going to spray it up under here. We're just going to spray it. We're hoping that that will help. All right, so these are the ones we got. We got the oh, it, and then one Tomcat thing. live catch trap. Okay, chew your medicine. Get a bite. No, it's and like so this. The way and it then works. they go all the way in, and then they push on this. Yeah, when they try to go this. eat the bait in the back, then it kicks it up. Yeah. That traps them, and then when it comes back down, then they're trapped in between the front and the back. Yeah, here, nice. Eat so your they medicine. can't get out. It goes right in the front. So we'll and catch them live. We'll just, see. We just go right here, I and then dive. boom. But she has a much in, more cold heart. Than in, in all reality, I don't really want to kill happen. anything, yeah. but if, so if it had to be that, well, can you hear me? I'm guessing you can't, because there is a mouse trap down below me. Look, Donna. Oh, it's up under here. There's the trap. What? What? If you go... What is it? It's a mouse trap. So, we'll see if we catch him. What? what Hopefully what we does catch him. What does it do? It doesn't kill him. It doesn't once. kill him. No, we'll have to what let him go. We'll take him far, far away and we'll let him go. Check out our other videos over here. Leave a comment and tell us what you like. Yeah. Thumbs up! <laughs> and find out what happens with the mice. Ooh.